no, 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 no. <laughs> right, guys, welcome to the channel. Back onto golf videos now. Right, we're down here at the Trafford Centre at golf again. We're going to give Top Tracer a go again. Seen all the different things about it, so we're going to have a real good play. And is Top Tracer putting the fun back into golf for people? Let's go and find out. Hi right, guys, as you can see, you scan your code uh, on the on the board. Once you've downloaded the app, it keeps a record of it all for you. So we're going to start off with longest drive. So that was a seven iron. Forty-six yards. What we'll do now, guys? We'll get the uh, we'll get the driver out. See what we can uh, do on the driver. Oh yes, yeah, so we've got right. Not bad. Right, what we'll do now is we'll clip and we'll choose closest to the pip. When you've downloaded the app, this does um, all stick to your phone. So 146 to the pin. the green missed the green it rolled off Fourteen to the pin. Oh. Oh. Hear the hole in one. This is one of a go.
Right guys, so that's, uh, that's we've done at the top tracer now. Um, yeah, I do think, I've been used it a couple of times now, it's a good idea for getting people into golf. Um, there's a lot of people playing there today that have hired clubs. I think it's a, a driver and an iron they give you. I think it's, I think it's at a five, or I could be wrong, could be less. Um, so if you've like, never played golf before, you can come down, you can hit a few balls. Um, I think it's one to four players on the top tracer for doing the different games, which we've gone through with the video. Um, so if four of you come along and uh, you all bought 120 balls, and it's uh, you have a good evening. Because I believe you can get beer and food delivered to your bay, so you can make an eye of it. And you can have a laugh and a joke, and I suppose, you know, if you suddenly enjoy it, you may want to go and get out on the course, which is a good way of starting people on the course, I suppose. You know, they can come down and try it out without going down and getting embarrassed. Which a lot of people might find they might do on a golf course. They usually could try it out, enjoy it. And obviously there is an American golf here as well. Where they can go and buy some clubs. Had a quick look at the uh, second hand stuff. Not not cheap. Um, there's no cheap sets of 100 quid. They're all well over 100, 150, 200, 300 pound. Um, compared to Stockport where I went yesterday and they had some for 50, 50 I think the lowest was 50 quid so yeah so um, it's a good way to start and a good way to have some fun especially to put, uh, get kids involved you know if you've got some kids bring them down it's a few balls uh, and they can enjoy it I think the games are fun uh, obviously you've got your longest drive mine obviously went hot right and then you can play the full round of uh, St Andrews, which is good. I think I did a par on one of them, which was quite good. So yeah, but um, it's uh, what was it? I think it was ten pound for 120 balls, and eight pound for your top tracer for the hour. So 18 pound in total. Probably a little bit on the expensive side for my liking, uh, but I suppose you got to pay for the technology. Uh, it just you know, saves you going having lessons, you can see what you're doing wrong, you can see where the ball's going and how far you're hitting it. Because obviously on a course, sometimes you just you just don't know. So yeah, so it's uh, it could put the fun back in golf, I think it will do. Um so yeah, so I hope you enjoyed the video. Get out to your local top tracer. Don't forget to download the app as well, you need the app. Um, where is it? I'll find it for you. Obviously, you've got the app there, you download it and you just scan your code in and uh, it automatically recognises you and it saves all your data. Uh, it tells you what's, what stats you've got. Um, and for some reason it doesn't want to work at the minute. We shall have a look at that later. So yeah, so you can tell you know, how far you eat each club um, and all the things you need to know, which is good. So if you're out on the course and you think, ooh, what do I hit my two iron, my three iron? You can have a quick look if you can't remember. So, hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Thumbs up. Subscribe. I'll put it up here somewhere, down here. And, um, yeah. Hopefully, 
next week we're uh, we're going down to Hartford. Hopefully, we'll be able to test out a few uh, a few clubs for you. Any new ones that come out, we're going to give them a go. See what we think. I give an unbiased opinion of what I think they're like and whether I'll pay for for them. So that's to come next week. Um, and what else we got coming up? I can't remember. Oh, we got a fitting day in about two weeks. This one is definitely going to go ahead. The last one got cancelled. So we've got a fitting day um, as well, which is going to video. Should be good, we've never had anything done like that before. And the sun is right behind me, as you're probably sneaking through. So, I'm just mumbling. Hi right, guys, speak to you soon. If you're out this week, have some good shots. Enjoy your golf, remember always have a smile. We'll see you later. Arrivederci. Au revoir. Laters, dude. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs>